I'm trying to pollinate this corn. You only get so many days. And for such a small crop, you're better off trying to hand pollinate it. So I've been trying to pick what the bees are going at because obviously there's pollen on that. But um, I also sometimes do that and see if I see any pollen fall off of them. Is that rain? Yeah, it's rain. And so I just rub it on the silk and I do like tapping in case it needs that for the pollen to come out. And I just toss it aside, grab another one. I'm trying to rub on all these silks with mm. the tassels. The ones that's light colored. Uh, I don't know if the, I don't know if the red means they're pollen in or what. Oh. Um, I just know they turn red after they emerge. Oh, okay. It could be that they're pollinated. I don't I don't know. Uh, they're beautiful. Yeah. That's the most beautiful tassels I've ever seen on corn. I'm talking about these ribbons over here, which that looks like that's made in here with corn there. Which this is heirloom. So, it's not uh, the modern sweet corn. This is the heirloom sweet corn. So. But I mean, I just try to pollinate them. Help them along. Because, uh, you know, I didn't know there was going to be these bees, and I'm sure these bees are helping, but there's no guarantee they're going to hit all these. So. Um. Yeah, but that's the corn, and as you can see, we're a top garden, so it'll grow in a top garden. Till next time.